FreeMMOStation.com What's up guys, Flynn1 here from It's Gamers Anonymous, recording for FreeMMOStation.com today, bringing you a beta game. Not out yet, but it's going to be awesome. I've been playing for a little bit. It's called Gundog. Pretty much what it is, is like if you threw animals instead of people in Team Fortress 2 is so cool, just like it. So, let's go ahead and get on into this game here. <coughs> As you can tell, there's one server up since the beta. There's three channels. Alright, claim, claim great. Alright, pretty much, let's go around this little store here show you what's going on. Uh, right here are the different game lobbies you get to join. You can do quick join or anything you can do. You have your channel, which one you're in, your tutorials, your notices, tells you what's going on. You have your shop, which pretty much you can buy with money or with stuff you unlock in the game. You're able to choose which side, either the uh, red or blue team, the empire, or the union. Each one, sorry about that. Each one has their own special unique abilities. When you start off your game, you will choose one c character class for your union and one character class for your empire. I have gone with rifle for my union and sniper for my empire. I'll show you how to change that here in a second. But as you can see, each one has their own little different abilities on stuff you can get. You can rent stuff, make custom stuff. It's uh, really cool. Those aren't actually available yet because uh, it's a beta. Uh, your storage is basically the stuff you have on your pack. As you can see, here's my union guy. Here's my regular guy. Um, you can unlock later on other people so you can see. Pick your cards later on uh, for which character you want to use. But right now you can only pick two for each account. Uh, your collection is basically different cards you've unlocked for each one. Storage details. Alright. Now here's your extra character. This is basically your stats and your detailed info on which uh, character is going on. You can see which one you have available up to three characters to start off with, but there's only one since it's a beta. This is your social media where you get to see all your friends. You can send gifts. And see, I got tutorial reward for completing the tutorial, so I can receive it. And I have 5,000 gold. And then you have your clan which isn't available yet because it's, it's beta, then you can actually search for people. So that's pretty cool. And then you have, of course, your settings. Now that I've showed you what the menu is like, very simple. And of course, these are different ma macros of who you want to talk to, stuff like that, your friends, users, pretty much all that self-explanatory. So let's go ahead and get into a game. We're going to do a quick join. Very easy to join a match, um, just like Team Fortress, so you're able to see everything, and we're going to start it up. And there we go. We're going to launch to a game. I like the start menu. Reminds me a lot of Team Fortress 2. It really does. Um, but as you can see, since there is limited to one account, I can only show you what the sniper and the rifleman does. But it looks like I am on... I am on the... I am on the, um... Empire side. Alright, so pretty much as you can see right now, it looks very cartoony. Kind of like Borderlands mixed with some, some uh... Team Fortress 2, but to move around, you're just WASD. You actually have your jump is space. You have your melee, which is your E to interact, or F is melee, E is to pick up items. To switch your weapon is Q. You get to choose which grenade you want to throw by using your scroll button. And then you can actually throw a grenade with G, as you can see right here. I'll just toss that grenade. And as you see right here, you hold shift, you have a special run, since you're a dog. You pop that shift while you run it forward, and boom, here you go. Alright, here we go. And I died. <laughs> so, pretty much, that's the controls. I'm gonna turn this down, it's in very, very loud. Okay, let's go with my sniper. And while you're in, you can actually uh, switch classes to video what's going on. And we lost the game already. Wow, that was really quick. Okay, so that was the first game. Let's go back out here. Let's see. Let's go back out. You just hit your escape button to go back out. Um, since these guys are playing, let's go into the team challenge. And we're going to go on to the union side. No, I don't want to do that. And we're going to go ahead and join the union. 
so I can show you guys what the rifle does. But, pretty much, um, oh, it looks like you can click your center mouse button to uh, throw your grenade as well. And as you can tell, I have to wait till he goes. Okay, the levels are really diverse. It's really cool. Good luck. Um, as you can see, it's very cartoony. I love that. You can even see in the uh, in the game. Uh, you can even see in the uh, loading menu when you see that it's a common trick. So that is really cool. All right, here we go. So I can't kill some people here. I cannot wait to see this game actually load out for for real. I'll throw a grenade in there. As you can tell, oh, that's really cool. I didn't even notice that. When you actually shoot. Mission clear. Oh wow, we won already. Somehow. All right, team, take that. <laughs> Good luck. Okay, now as you see, when you shoot, you actually get little comic book stuff. So it's very comic based. I love that a lot, actually. Now let's see what we can get here. But to aim is your uh, right mouse button, to fire is your left. Of course, as with any shooter. Warning. Here we go, here we go. Oh, we got somebody, and I died from the grenade. A kamikaze. Oh, God. You hit me, don't put up that menu, by the way. This is actually really fun. The games are actually pretty short, I'm going to find out. Um, a lot of people are thinking that heavies are the way to go, but I highly recommend using something a little more fast paced, you get a more, better fire rate. I just think it's really cool that each one is a different type of dog. This one looks like he has a beard for some reason, and we won that one, yeah. So there's nine rounds, but as you can tell, the, the games don't last too long. They're like two minutes each round, very quick, very short. So if you're on a break or something, Good luck. like uh, like let's say you're doing some homework or you're doing stuff around the house, you want to take a little break, this game would be perfect for you to do a couple rounds and just uh, rock on with people. I find that very cool. Very excited to see what the actual game turns out to be like. Not sure when the release date is though. That's the one thing I'm not sure. Oh shit! Okay. Let's go ahead and switch it and throw a grenade. Looks like there's a flashbang. I don't know where anybody is. One thing I don't like is that your dash actually runs out or your stamina, so you actually have to let it recharge. No, I'm not. I died. Tab is to pull up the screen, by the way. Oh, at least you, looks like you get points for healing. That's really cool. Man, he is ripping the blood with that freaking rocket launcher. Look at that. There's a guy next to you. Guy next to you. Run, man, run. Oh, we fell. Round 10. Here we go. I think this is the last round. <coughs> Alright, let's do this, y'all. Good luck. Going in first. I'm gonna rock the pistol. Cause I got raped with this with the rifle. Yo. I'm going up against the rocket guy, I gotta catch him on the reload. Yo, I got killed. Man, it actually shows when you die by a player how many times they've actually killed you. I find that really cool. I find that to be a really cool uh, 
aspect of the game. Man, it looks like Kite is raping with that rocket launcher right now. So I guess it's gonna be um it seems like it's kind of really heavy weapon uh dominant right now. But a lot of the games I've played and the ones I've seen, I've seen regular, uh, just regular overall people rock really hard with a machine gun or a assault rifle. I've never seen anybody do that, but anyways, guys, that was some of the gameplay. That was an introduction to the game. Hopefully there's going to be more coming out, considering there's not too much with the beta right now. But if you guys are interested, make sure you keep updated and keep checking in, and we will release the launch date when we find out. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. This is Flynn one from It's Gamers Anonymous, recording for free MMOStation.com. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I will see you guys next time. Maybe I'll see you online when the game launches. Who knows? Later, y'all.